welcome back to my channel hope you guys doing well today's makeup look is this which i really wanted to show you because this is my favorite 2017 summer makeup look and i know some of you might be thinking that the summer is over but officially summer is not over because we still have a couple of weeks for the fall so i quickly wanted to show you what was my 2017 favorite summer makeup look this is quite easy um it's quick it's bright uh, so that's why i always love and i wear majority of the time this makeup look and i especially love this lip color basically i think so that this lip color uh um what should i say this lip color actually is for the summer i am not sure whether i can wear it in fall or winter i don't think so maybe in winter yes but not in the fall or maybe yes because there is no such particular rule for wearing a makeup but i really wanted to show you guys that this is my favorite makeup look this is quite easy summery and quick okay so just start with um i wanted to put this on screen and moisturize on my face because sunscreen is something which i always want for my summers winters or any sort of weather so doesn't matter what type of day it is or what type of weather it is or what type of season it is i always want sunscreen so i already put that and to apply my foundation i'm just gonna put some my this body shop the oil of life as to give a good hydration to my skin this glowing and hydrated skin we will move to our foundation so for foundation i'm going to use my maybelline new york super stay better skin skin transforming foundation this is broad spectrum spf 15 this is with acetyl oil free so it's affordable second thing is because it has a spf i can use it on everyday basis so just take a few pumps on my back of the palm and put some dots this is quite a bit of darker just a bit one shade darker for my skin but after um concealing and setting off it uh, this matches to my skin perfectly so i'm not worried about that and then take a wet beauty blender and just blend it And I'm actually using this particular one on daily basis and this stays so long and it matches and emerge or get into your skin so perfectly that it doesn't feel like that you have put any foundation. So that's the best part and it gives you quite good coverage as well. Now for concealing I'll be using my Tarte Shape Tape Contour Concealer. This lid as well now I've said all those areas I'm going to use my kick ass soap and glory instant retouch press powder which is like this one. set all those areas no crazy baking nothing just don't want that uh, super shiny skin I froze off the camera so I'll be right back Okay, so my eyebrows looks pretty fine to me now. So moving on to the face again, I'm going to use my Hula Benefit Bronzer. I generally don't do the contouring when I am actually, uh, you know, getting into hurry or I just want to get ready as quick as possible and, you know, I want to look best even. So I just want to take, just taking this Hula Bronzer and... are definitely pretty much dirty so don't mind about that but i'm gonna make it very quick so for my daily routine and for my quickest and favorite summer one i use these shades and i keep it a bit of the smoky but still easy i use this shade sorry 
this shade right here. I want to put uh, this one on my eye crease. very light and I'll just take it a little crease as well. The B area a bit smoky uh, so I will be going for this dark shade right here. brush and with the flat brush I'm gonna take this lightest shade right here and we work we'll put this on my eyelid front area so that is a maximum I do for my eyes using my uh, L'Oreal Lash Paradise L'Oreal Lash Paradise and I guess this much is enough for the mascara so I like my lashes to look more thick and more white so I'm gonna add some fake lashes but that is just right on the corners of the eyes not the full lashes so so I like my lashes to look very thick so uh, after the uh, after mascara I will be putting these false lashes which I cut into two pieces um, and I'm just gonna put this on the, I'm gonna put this one on the end only uh, so that my eyelashes will look more thick and it will make your eyes look more wide open so I'm sure you guys can see how much different this is made just to put the false lashes. I don't know what is wrong with me, but I just forgot about my words. I speak very slow when I'm filming a video. I just really don't understand how, why and how does that happen. Okay, so this is what I do with my lashes. It looks, it gives me a cat eye touch without doing much for the cat eye. I'll finally and quickly just take this brush and take my eyeshadow, the lightest shade, and put on the corners. I'll be taking the darkest shade which we used. I'll be taking the darkest shade which we used for the smoking of my eye. blending brush and blending it out take my water black eye pencil which is in which is by Milani liquid eye and we'll just tie in my water line Taking it as a highlighter for my eyelid as well, for my nose. So my face. Now moving on to the lips. My favorite and the Maybelline's Maybelline um, the best product which I like from the Maybelline till now in lip collection is this Maybelline New York uh, Super Stay Matte. Ink. This is from the Maybelline Super Stay Matte, ink, and this is in the shade. Um, Heroin. Uh, I don't know whether you have seen me using this formula. I don't think so that I've used this formula in my any other video, but Now I'm gonna fix everything from my setting spray
favorite uh, this is my favorite look from this 2017 summer and I like how this comes up because um, the eyes are pretty easy but the lip color is quite bright and it, it actually pops up and makes your whole look a very you know summer and summery and you know um, so here is this makeup look i hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you really did do not forget to subscribe on my channel and do not forget to follow me on instagram snapchat and twitter i'm back on twitter i hope you guys to see you in my next video i will see you in my next video on next thursday till then take care bye bye